Hi, this is Jules Christine. Welcome to this guided meditation where we will journey to the hidden world of dragons. On this journey, we are going to the hidden world where all dragons live safely. There are many types of dragons there and you will get to see them all. You will also become one with the mind and power of the dragon. Please find a place where you are not distracted, either sitting or lying down. Focus on your breathing. Breathing in light, love, and peace. And on your out breath, letting go of all tension and pain that your body is holding on to. Repeat this process several times so that you're breathing in light, love, and peace. And on your out breath, you're releasing all that does not serve you. I'd like you to now shift your attention to your feet. Relax your feet and imagine that they are getting heavier and heavier. Your toes, your ankles, and the soles of your feet are very, very relaxed. And there is the light of the golden sun hovering over them and moving through them, keeping them very relaxed. Now shift your focus up to the calf muscles and your knees. Imagine that you can see that golden sun light over this area of your body and you're moving that light backwards and forwards over that area. And as that light shines on your calf muscles and your knees, this part of your body becomes very relaxed. Now move that light of the sun up through your thighs and your hips, moving this energy of light backwards and forwards over this area, keeping you very, very relaxed. Now move that light over your stomach, right up to your chest and into your shoulders. Moving that light back and forwards over this entire area, feeling that light penetrate right through to your back. Your body is very relaxed. Moving this light all the way up to your head and down your arms to your fingertips. So that right now, from the tip of your head to the tip of your toes, you are filled with light and you are very, very relaxed. And now you are prepared for your journey. 
Imagine yourself standing outside in a large field and it's a beautiful day. You hear a whisper on the wind and it's saying to you that the hidden world of dragons is waiting for you. As you're standing there, a large orb of light descends down from the heavens and lands right in front of you. This orb of light has all colors of the rainbow in it and a dragon's eye is looking right at you. You have no fear because your higher self is letting you know that you are safe and that you are divinely protected. You are guided to gently step into this orb of light that acts like a vehicle and when you are completely inside of it this orb of light starts to climb high up into the sky. As you go higher and higher, you feel the lightness of being and a higher consciousness. The higher you go, the lighter you feel. Then this orb of light stops at its destination and it lets you out into a long golden hallway. As you stand looking at this very long hallway, you see doors on the left and doors on the right. These doorways lead you to different dimensions on our planet. There is a guardian of this golden hall that suddenly shows up and he's standing right in front of you. This guardian is very ancient and he is carrying a tall staff with what looks like a dragon's eye on the top of it. This guardian has a long white beard and long white hair. He smiles at you and when he does his face lights up like a Christmas tree. He is very happy to see you and can feel that you love dragons and that you are pure of heart. As he's smiling at you, he takes you by the hand and leads you down this magnificent hallway. He stops at a door on the right and as you both stand in front of this doorway you see that it has scales on it and it looks like it's alive. You touch it and it's rippling and moving underneath your hand. This ancient guardian touches this door with his mighty staff and the door opens. You both step through and you're immediately taken into the mountains. 
you are standing right in front of the highest peak. Your guardian starts walking in front of you and leads you to what looks like a very large opening in the mountain. It's a short walk, and when you get to this opening, you see that it's a very large cave. As you stand there, your guardian summons your dragon for you. And your dragon lies down so that you can climb upon its back. Your dragon then takes you into the cave where there is a huge opening in the ground. This opening looks like an endless hole. Just when you think there must be another way to go, your dragon spreads his wings and dives down into this immense hole. Suddenly you drop and it feels like you're on a roller coaster. You're hanging on for dear life and your dragon tells you not to worry. Down and down you go and as you go, there are lights glowing all around you. You feel excited as you feel your stomach drop. You let out a little scream of excitement. When you get to the bottom, your dragon evens out in flight and moves forward through an underground world. This world has crystals everywhere. You see all around you stalactites and stalagmites. As you're flying along, you see all colors of the rainbow everywhere and you see so many types of dragons as you're flying you see large dragons small dragons baby dragons and even dragon eggs all around you there are dragons of every color and as you fly along, you're amazed at how many different types of dragons there are. Some have really big heads. Some have knobby heads. Some have arrows on their tails and spikes coming out of their heads. So many different types of funny looking dragons. Some of them are elemental dragons. Some are mother dragons. And some are alpha dragons. This underground world is massive and it's all very exciting. As your dragon is still flying, you see ahead of you a very large mound and it's glowing with light. Your dragon flies over to it and settles down. As you are both 
sitting on this glowing mound, your dragon calls out to all the other dragons. He roars the loudest sound you have ever heard. All of the other dragons reply with a roar and all of them gather around you. The energy of all these dragons is absolutely amazing. These dragons are bowing their heads and flittering their tails as their souls are rising up and becoming one very large etheric dragon. This is the one mind of all dragons, one power, one vision. You are becoming one with this mighty energy, one with the infinite consciousness of all dragons. You are the power. You are the vision. You are the magic. As above, so below, the two are becoming one. Amare Rakutri Hala Nathbra Isapakuri Alana Namare Pula Navira Shanda Banusi Ilanandara Amira Truviola Shakila Moria Om Shasakalira Raku 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 Hala Nathbra is the breath of life. Isapakuri is a higher consciousness. And Amare is infinite love. Feel this power. Feel at one with the great dragon mind. Know that you are all powerful, that you are infinite and limitless. As you feel this immense energy, you look down at your body and you see that scales are forming on your arms and that you and these dragons are all one. Suddenly you realize you can see in the darkness that your eyesight has changed and become more powerful Feel the dragon's protection. Feel their love and feel their power. Now that you are one, with all dragons, 
your dragon knows that it's time and he's feeling your connection. He knows that this connection is complete. So he takes off and flies out over all of the dragons as they all cry out in unison. You both fly in and around the one power of all these dragons, the etheric form that they have created. The energy rises and rises when you can rise no more. As you're floating around this immense underground world, your dragon brings you back to the mound and commands the other dragons to lower their energies. As you sit on your dragon, you are mesmerized and you feel blissful. You feel tingly from head to toe. Your dragon gives you a few minutes to relax and come back into your being, into your body. Then he gives one more roar and takes off back out through this massive underground world. You are both passing all the crystals, all the stalactites and the stalagmites. flying past all the baby dragons. When you reach that massive hole and your dragon starts climbing up through the hole higher and higher, you hang on as he soars to the top of the hole, finally reaching the cave. And then he walks out of the cave back to your guardian, who has been patiently waiting for you outside. As you are brought back to your guardian, your dragon takes you and lets you get down off of his back and then embraces you with his wings and then he gives you a name this is your dragon name please take that with you and remember it your dragon is smiling at you and taps you on your head, laughing and giggling to himself with a toothy grin. Your dragon looks into your eyes and he says to you, Little one, this is the beginning and the end all at the same time. You look at him curiously, and he says, You know the answer. You just have to open your dragon mind and believe. Your guardian walks you back to the doorway. 
and taps on it with his staff. And the door opens so that both of you can walk back into the golden halls. Your guardian leads you back down the golden hall, back to your orb of light vehicle with the dragon's eye that's blinking at you. You look at the guardian and you both start laughing. You step back into this orb of light and this vehicle floats back down. Down it comes, all the way down. Coming back down to your body, back down to this present moment in this third dimension, back to this time and place. And when it reaches the ground, you step out of this light and the orb disappears. Relax in this moment and just float. Just be. Be in the moment. Feel the energy. Think of your dragon name and always remember this hidden world of dragons. I'm going to count from one to five and when I reach five, you will come back to full consciousness where you will feel refreshed and alive. You'll come back feeling wide awake, strong and empowered. One, begin to come back. Two, slowly come back into your awareness. Three, remember you will be wide awake and feeling empowered. Four, you're almost there. You're beginning to open your eyes. Five, come back to your breathing. Breathing in and out with awareness, knowing that you are back to this current time and place. When you're ready, open your eyes, grounding yourself back into your perfect life. knowing that you are blessed, you are powerful, you are magic, and that you are transformed. <laughs>